After what has been a momentous week, I'm here to talk to you guys about the poles. Not the kind of hard-working poles that Nigel Farage trains his dog to bark at, but the exit poles, and the Brexit poles, and the would you eat the sausage before the egg bit polls? See, the exit polls, which are meant to predict the winner of the US election, got it totally wrong. Totally bloody fucking wrong. And that seems to be becoming the norm at the minute. We had the Brexit poll, which told us that we'd remain in the EU. The last election, we had polls that said that there wouldn't be a Tory party majority. The Scottish referendum poll said that the Scots would be leaving us. And in the would you eat the sausage before the egg bit poll, well, I didn't even end up conducting it because I realised that polls are a complete fucking waste of time. All the polls had a Hillary Clinton victory. All of the polls. All the polls. The pollsters sat outside voting booths or they cold called the voters, apparently speaking to over 85,000 people. And the people lied. Or they just didn't answer and we ended up with some bullshit figure that literally didn't mean anything. What an absolute waste of time. But why am I not surprised? The polls are conducted by polling companies but they're for the big media outlets. And what do Trump supporters think of the media? The media is rigged. It's rigged. It's crooked as hell. Now why would they tell the people in the media who they're voting for? I believe actually they are more crooked than crooked Hillary. I really do. That's a lot. Also, it's funny telling these pollsters the wrong answer. If I was a Republican, I'd have been howling with laughter at the idea of Hillary practicing her acceptance speech, knowing full well that me and all my mates had lied to this gullible pollster on the phone. I'm voting for crooked Hillary. Also, cold calling. I hate cold calling. I've been told so many times that I've been in a car accident that wasn't my fault, that I'm actually starting to believe that it might be true. Just kidding, it was definitely my fault. <laughs> Back to Brexit. I have a feeling this is another Brexit. You know that many of the people who voted for Brexit were actively voting against the sort of form-filling bureaucracy that membership of the EU had come to represent. I hardly think that they're the kind of people who are going to go outside after they voted and want to fill in a form. I don't even believe the polls. So let's do away with the polls. They're bullshit anyway. I'm saying bullshit. Bullshit. You know what a referendum is, right? Or an election? It's a poll. Why don't we just wait a few hours and get the result of that one? An actual accurate one that you can't just lie about what you did. Anyway, until next time, I've been Brook Driver. Don't forget that if you've enjoyed this video, please like our page and... Excuse me, where's the lobby? Down the hall and grab him by the pussy. Thanks.